Celebrity Big Brother Season 2. Yay! So this is going to be a two-part, two-night premiere. Um, this series is, or this season is going to be one month long. It's 12 housemates, 12 house guests, sorry. Um, and the first one is Ryan Lochte. I absolutely know nothing about Big Brother. Um, he was a swimmer in the U.S. Olympics. Well, this is just like the first group. It was Ryan Lochte, Lolo Jones, who is another Olympian, had no idea who she was, Eva Marie, who was a former wrestler in the WWE. She's very pretty. And the next person is Tom Green, who was a, like, I guess he was a comedian slash actor back, like, in the very early 2000s. He had a show on MTV called The Tom Green Show. I used to watch it back when I was a kid. It was very, like, weird and, I don't know, just very, like, millennial stuff. Apparently, he lost his right testicle due to cancer. Kato Kalin is the next house guest. He was... A uh, friend of OJ Simpson's, and he, apparently he was at OJ Simpson's house the night he did or did not murder that woman. Tamar Braxton is the next house guest, and she is Tony Braxton's little sister. She's also like a singer, I guess. She's on a talk show. She had her own show with her sisters. Um, very energetic, you know, bringing that. So those six go in the house, and they kind of start talking and hanging out and stuff. We see how they start talking about how they know each other and if any of them know each other. None of them seem to know each other except for Lolo Jones and Ryan Lochte. So you guys know each other? Yeah. Yes. How do you guys know each other? From the oh, Olympics. From the Olympics. Yeah. 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 I know. <laughs> except for but none of them really seem surprised that each other, that like we're in the house. So, you know, obviously they've seen some type of list and they knew who was going to be in the house. Um. Anyway, the next group that comes in starts off with Jory Lawrence who is, I guess he's most famous from the show Blossom. I've never seen that show, but is it me or did Joey Lawrence have this New Jersey accent all of a sudden that he didn't have before? The next house guest is Dina Lohan. What else do you need to say about Dina Lohan? She is Lindsay Lohan's mom. There you go. Jonathan Bennett, speaking of Lindsay Lohan, Jonathan Bennett is the next house guest. Uh, he played Aaron Samuels in Mean Girls. Nothing in math class could mess me up. Hey, do you have a pencil I can borrow? Candy Burris is the next house guest. She is from the Real Housewives of Atlanta. She also is like a singer, songwriter back in the day. Apparently she wrote No Scrubs by TLC. I had no idea. Ricky Williams is the next house guest and he used to play for the NFL. Wow, so exciting. Anthony Scaramucci is the next house guest. He was a member of Trump's cabinet for like literally three days or something like he got fired by Trump for I don't remember why. He said it was for swearing, but I don't know if that's the whole truth so at this point all the house guests are in the house julie tells all the house guests that their first hoh comp is going to be starting like immediately that they have to get in pairs power pairs just like beyonce and jay-z she says since ryan was the first house guest he is the first to choose his partner he chooses jonathan Jonathan picks the next person to choose their partner, and he chooses Tamar, and Tamar chooses Candy to be her partner. Candy chooses the next person to choose partners, and it was Joey. Joey picks Ricky. Ricky picks Lolo to choose her partner. She picks Tom. Tom picks Dina to choose her partner, and she picks Anthony. Natalie and Kato did not get picked, so they are out of the um, HOH comp, but they're also safe from the first week's eviction. Okay, so here's the HOH comp, because I'm not going to explain it. It's, like, kind of complicated, so here it is. I might go. Each pair will start swinging. As a team, you must transfer champagne from your giant champagne bottle to your giant champagne glass on the other side of the yard. At first, they started like this. Then they ended up getting the swing of it. I <laughs> get it. It's neck and neck between Ryan and Jonathan and Lolo and Tom. But eventually, Ryan and Jonathan win making them the two finalists for the HOH for the first week. And that's all for the first part of the first episode. Night two, Jonathan is like trying to start an alliance with Ryan and some of the other girls, basically all of the like younger house guests. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lolo and Tamar go to talk to Joey about an alliance and he says, What alliance, bang, I hate that word. A little bit later, everyone watches Ryan swim. A little later, we see Lolo, Jonathan, uh, Ryan, and the wrestler girl, I forgot her name, Eva Marie, Ava Marie or something. Um, they start an alliance called For Sure. For Sure. 
while and then we see tamar and some of the other girls trying to start their own alliance like the four girls and they're like it never works with just girls and they're like even destiny's child couldn't hold it together and i was like girl ain't that the truth okay so the actual hoh comp is ryan and jonathan they have to like swing from these buildings and completely knock over two billboards with their faces on them to no one's surprise the olympic champion ryan won the athletic comp the physical comp uh which means jonathan is on the block ryan then i guess this was a twist because the other house guests looked really surprised i guess ryan has to choose two other house guests to also be up with jonathan and he picks the mooch and tom green i'm very happy with those decisions i mean they're boring so get them the fuck out of there they're boring and they're old get them out <laughs> uh that's it i guess thanks for watching